hi my little hearts okay welcome back again okay in this video we are going to discuss um uh, chapter i think this is the second chapter and uh, that is uh, every drop and every step matters what is this every drop and every step see children you all are there in the second standard okay you can understand very clearly that every drop drop of a water is a more precious than whatever is there on this whole earth because without water it's not at all possible for us to live to survive our life not only us along with us other animals that may be the small animal or that may be the biggest animal and along with us and the other animals even the plants do need the water if there is no water it's not possible for all the living things to live and survive their life then water is a most important then by saving a drop of water you may ask the question now that uh, ma'am we are so small we are at in uh, at, we are just in a second standard how can we help to save the water yeah i will tell you by doing the simple step by doing the simple activity not doing a big any other work and building a big water tank and saving there or going for the rain water harvesting and going to your field and doing two acre some uh, plan and all i will not tell you i will not suggest you to do this one because you all are safe you all are very small so being a small so as i told you every drop of water is a mat uh, it matters or it's most most important then how it is important i will tell you you can save a one drop of water if you save the one drop of water what will happen i will tell you see children uh, while using water we use water for many purposes every day i will uh, now talk with uh, very simple and personal things where we would use water for our personal things like drinking washing the face washing the hands and we use water after we use the toilet room bathroom okay and then in the bathroom also we use the water see i will take a small um, example if i want to drink water i will take a glass i will uh, take water in the glass this is a very simple activity okay you take the water as much as you can drink see if suppose you are very thirsty take full glass of water and drink full water okay and then if you are not that much thirsty you want uh, half of a glass is enough for you then take only half of a glass okay don't take full glass and drink half and you know, throw half no it's so wastage of water then other than this we take brush every day isn't it so of course we know we all have a sink basin and uh, tap will be there the water will be running and we will be brushing for a 10 minutes minimum or minimum 5 minutes see children have you ever thought if i waste running water in the sink for 5 minutes there will be somewhat wastage of uh, 4 to 5 jug of water it's a, um, a rough calculation i am giving you okay so i will on the tap for 5 minutes as i want 5 minutes for brushing my teeth those 5 minutes minimum 5 jugs of water will be wasted only for me for one day then as i am doing all the my family members will do then even they are also going to waste five jugs five jugs suppose we are four members at one house and each of us are wasting five jug of water then five into four five fours are 20 jugs of water that is minimum one big bucket for one day in a one house only for brushing we are wasting one big bucket of water this is very um small calculation okay i am giving you we may waste more than 5 jugs also okay then in house in a one uh, line that where we are staying or where we have our house so there may be the 10 houses those 10 houses 10 buckets only for the brushing then so like this we are wasting 1000 uh, together 1000 liters together uh for every one day for every day we are wasting only for brushing our teeth we waste liters thousand liters together 
thousand liters can you understand big water tank will be there no in that a uh, thousand liters two thousand liters three thousand liters five thousand liters like this water will be stored so only for one activity only for one row we will waste thousand liter of water then what about one village then what about one um uh, one city then what about one uh, um, taluk then what about one district then what about one uh, state then what about one country and then then what about the whole world do you know for a one day only for a one simple activity throughout the world billion million billion trillions together of liters will waste for only for a one hour just think of it children we all live for example 60 to 70 years then in a 70 years how many liters of water i waste only for a brushing isn't it now you have got the idea then why to save a drop of water now you got an idea yes exactly so simple thing you are you all are small even i can do this work you can easily we can do this work while brushing just turn off the tap even if you see anywhere on the street on the road in the school in the house neighbor if the tap is on water is running just go and off that tap turn off that tap that's it that is what the big work by saving a drop of water you are saving the whole world okay now you have got no for a one hour whole over the world if every one of us doing so like saving of the drop of a water then we can save the million trillion liters together water for a one hour so like this for each one of us we live 60 to 70 years throughout our life we can save one big river water of one big river that much water we can save if we save that much water our earth will be healthy and next generation will be healthy of course we also will be healthy okay i hope now you got the clear picture about the every step and the every drop matters in this we have discussed about every drop of the uh, drop matters okay then every step how it is going to matter we will discuss in the next video children uh, before ending this i hope you have understood whatever we have discussed in this video and um, there is not much um, Uh, uh topic i have covered to give you homework but i can give you simple question uh, write down the steps to save the drop of the water okay drop of the water i hope you will do write down the steps or measures and how do you save the water this is a question okay you can form this question however you want but you must write down some five to six steps or 10 steps that uh, other than whatever i have explained other than this also you can write down the different steps how we are we can save the water i hope you will uh, write this homework and let us meet in the next video till then take care of yourself and bye bye children